scientists find new clues about the exotic matter in the sun's atmosphere. They can use it to develop safe and clean nuclear energy generators here on Earth. A team of Irish and French scientists has discovered new clues into how matter behaves in the extreme conditions of the sun's atmosphere. They used ground-based radio telescopes and ultraviolet cameras mounted on a NASA spacecraft to better understand the exotic fourth state of matter. Known as plasma, this hot ionized gas consists of approximately equal numbers of positively charged ions and negatively charged electrons. The sun's plasma is so hot that the most energetic charged particles can escape from the sun's gravity and fly away out into space. It could hold the key to developing safe, clean and efficient nuclear energy generators on Earth. Dr. Owen Carley, a researcher at Trinity College, Dublin and Dublin Institute of Advanced Studies explains how most of the matter we encounter in our everyday lives comes in the form of solid, liquid, or gas. But the majority of the universe is composed of plasma, a highly unstable and electrically charged fluid. Plasma still remains a mystery, and that's due to its scarcity in natural conditions on Earth, which makes it difficult to study. But the sun is the best place to study how plasma behaves in extreme conditions that are not possible to recreate here on Earth. The sun's atmosphere is home to extreme activity with plasma temperatures in excess of 1 million degrees Celsius and particles that travel close to the speed of light. These particles shine bright at radio wavelengths so scientists are able to monitor exactly how plasmas behave with large radio telescopes. Scientists have known about this activity for decades, but the use of space and ground-based equipment allows them to image the radio pulses for the first time and see exactly how plasmas become unstable in the solar atmosphere. Studying the behavior of plasmas on the sun will help us learn how they behave on Earth. These are nuclear energy generators that are much safer, cleaner, and more efficient than their fission reactor cousins that we currently use for energy today. Nuclear fusion is a different type of nuclear energy generation that fuses plasma atoms together as opposed to breaking them apart as fission does. Fusion doesn't require highly radioactive fuel. In fact, much of the waste material from fusion is inert helium. However, Peter Gallagher, a professor at the Dublin Institute of Advanced Studies and collaborator on the project, says the only problem is that nuclear fusion plasmas are highly unstable. He explains how as soon as the plasma starts generating energy, some natural process switches off the reaction so the plasma is difficult to maintain in a stable state for energy generation. By studying how plasmas become unstable on the sun, we can learn about how to control them on Earth. <laughs>